everyone, it's Carly. Welcome here back to my channel. I am so happy you guys are all here today because hopefully today's gonna be a really fun vlog. Um, I woke up today, it is Monday. It's actually a little bit like rainy and colder. That's why I'm wearing like a long sleeve and a hat. But um, so it's a little like gloomy day. I had a lot of work to do, but then I figured I would like treat myself to um, run a couple errands to a thrift store. So I haven't been since gosh i don't know the beginning of covid i mean i guess so but i haven't been uh since they've opened up and so i figured i would go out there today i do have something specific in mind um i have jean shorts that i want to find i don't know if i'm gonna find them to be honest but i want to check there first uh just to see so i thought that i would bring you guys along with me i only have time for one store so it's not gonna be like an insane thrift haul and i thought this would be a little bit different because normally when i do my thrift haul like back in the day I used to go to multiple like I would take a whole day I would go to multiple different stores around the valley and collect all of these things for you and then show you guys a big haul at the end and sometimes I feel like those are really fun to watch um, but sometimes I feel like that's not a great uh, representation of <laughs> reality sometimes when thrifting and so I thought today would be nice just because I'm only going to one store and I also am giving myself a budget of like $20 um, just because I'm trying really hard to only spend $100 a month on clothing so I have $20 left so we'll see. Um, it is like the very end of June so I can wait a couple more days and then spend my budget again. Um, so anyway I thought I would just show you guys going to a thrift store on a budget and on a time crunch. So come along with me. If you guys like these types of videos and love thrift hauls like I do, give the video a huge thumbs up and subscribe if you are new. I would love to have you here on my channel for the next video and let's go shopping. Okay, we are here at the thrift store and like I mentioned, I want to come here and look for shorts um, just right before I like go online or go to the mall or try to find something like that because I'm looking at a lot from like Zara, but I want to go here first, um, especially because I did do that Shein order. I just want to like see if there's anything out. And obviously this is my first time back at a thrift store um, since all of this happened. So I'm interested to see. There's like a ton of people in the parking lot, uh, which makes me nervous because it's like a Monday, like mid morning. Um, so we'll see who's all in there, but hopefully it's not like packed. I can't really like tell but we will see um, but yeah one of my tips that I always always share to people who are trying to get into thrifting not really sure to start just have like an item that you're looking for whether that's like baskets for your home or I don't know like graphic tees or oversized t-shirts in the boy section or for me it's gonna be shorts so even if there's not shorts no actually <laughs> I was gonna say maybe I'll look in the jeans and like do it myself but that never works out ever 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 I am not great at that for some reason I'm not good at cutting pants into jeans so if there's no jeans then I might just um oh my gosh there's so many people am I gonna be nervous to film probably but um if there's no jeans then I only have time for one thrift store today so if there's nothing here then that's okay then I will look somewhere else but I'm just happy that I made it out here so I'm gonna grab my mask. I'm so excited to go in, even though it looks a little busy, but I think it'll be really fun just to browse around. And it's been, like I said, so long since I've been to the thrift store. So let's get going. Now, every time I go to the thrift store, I start in the homeware. I just feel like it's the easiest um, introduction into all of the searching. So I started here at the vases and the baskets and I actually came across the prettiest white vase. I feel like it was really like fun and contemporary and for $1.99 it wasn't too bad. And then I also spotted this really cute speckled vase that I thought was really pretty as well. Now this next item is probably one of my favorite things I've ever found. I always look for cute trays and baskets and stuff like that, but this tray actually like turns into the cutest tray that you can have breakfast in bed in and I die. I think it's the cutest, sweetest thing and it's actually in really good condition. I also thought that these cute um, little teacups would be nice for like a shot of espresso if you like have an espresso machine. I thought it would be so cute. So I definitely recommend looking in the dishes because you never know what you could find. 
After I was done with all of the homeware, I took a quick look at the dresses, didn't really find much, um, and then I looked through the long sleeves because I always have to look for white blouses, and I loved this one. You can't really tell, but it was like a light fabric with really pretty buttons, and I always just find the best oversized white blouses at the thrift store, so I had to highlight some of these. And then this next item, I don't even know what it is, but I found it towards like the bathroom stuff, which I always love to look at for like vintage mirrors. And I don't know if you put like belts or scarves or something, but it was just a really cool fabric and design and I wanted to showcase that. And then I always have to look for like a straw bag. There's tons of them at the thrift store right now and they're very in, especially for summer. So I wanted to show just a couple that I found. None that I wanted to pick up that were like perfect, but you can still find so many out there. Okay, we are back in the car. That was super busy and like completely picked apart. So it wasn't like a success. I kind of knew that I might not find like the style of shorts that I'm looking for and really wanting. So I think I'm just gonna have to go online um, and get them that way. But I did find some other things. I ended up, I think I showed you guys that white vase. I was gonna get it because it was so cute, but I literally have something wrong with me where I buy like so many vases, but I don't know what to do with them. And I think it's fun to like style with them. Um, but I have way too many. Um, and so I didn't need any more. So I put it back, but it was very hard for me. I also didn't get the bl uh, the white blouse because again, I have so many of them, even though they're all a little bit different. Um, I figured I would just let that live there. But I did pick up this jean skirt. Um, I'll have to show you when I get home and after like I wash it and stuff, but it has like a cute little front slit I don't know if that's like still in I like a jean skirt So I don't know it might be a little bit too long their dressing rooms were obviously closed So I couldn't go in there, but this was $6.99. Um, so we'll see how it fits but in the summer I really love a jean skirt. I just think they're so cute So it might be a little longer than I want um, But we'll have to see and then I picked up this bag. I just feel like this crossbody is so cute for being white It has like very minimal like not even staining like I'm just gonna give it like a really Really good clean through and I feel like it's so pretty like it's very deserty and I just feel like in the summer that's such a cute look and I only have like um, I only have a black crossbody purse like I only have black ones So I feel like this one was so cute and it has like a pocket in the back and it was very like nice and clean in the inside it's by Rappi, I don't even know. Um, but this one was $4.99. So I was like, that is so cute. I had cute shorts on and I was going to a concert or a farmer's market or something like that. I just feel like it's very, very cute. Um, so those are the two things that I got and I feel really good about them. I'm a little bit bummed about my shorts, but I kind of knew it, so I figured I'll just purchase online. But I'm gonna go home now and it wasn't a total fail, but um, it was fun, it was fun to get out there, but I will talk to you guys when I get home. Okay, so I'm back home, and I thought I would just kind of wrap up the vlog here. I will insert clips of me trying on the skirt, and also the purse as well, once I disinfect that. I thought I would show you the skirt. Um, so I just have it on right now, and it's actually so cute. And I love like the coloring, um, but I have to return it because do you guys see it's like there could be like four more of me so this is what happens with jean skirts it's like I can never find the perfect size so that's a huge bummer because from the front like how cute is that Ugh, I love jean skirts but this is not the one so I'm gonna return it even though I think it's so cute and it's really comfortable because it's like so roomy, but it's just not gonna work and I'm not gonna waste my time trying to figure it out. Sorry, it's a little bit dark, but there's like a better look at the coloring. I just think it's so pretty, but this this cannot happen, so. And then this is the cute little crossbody. I told you guys, it's like perfect. I love how it looks, like it's just really fun and cute. And again, just like that cute desert style, it has lots of space, people which is very nice for me. So I can have my camera, my phone, my wallet, whatever we're doing. It's just nice to have a fun, different crossbody. So I feel like that looks really cute. Imagine if I had like a hat on, it'd be so pretty. So thought I would just give you an update of the findings that I found on this thrift haul. I hope it was a 
good reminder that sometimes like you don't always find what you need at the thrift store but you never know what you could pick up so don't get defeated if you don't get everything on your wish list when you go to a thrift store that never happens for me sometimes I get really really lucky and sometimes like today I don't find anything I need um, but I find a couple things and sometimes I don't find anything and if I didn't find anything today I still would have uploaded this for you guys just to continue to inspire you to shop secondhand and check out your thrift stores and just give it a try it's really fun you can make a fun day out of it go with a friend try to find some treasures so give the video a huge thumbs up if you enjoyed it don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in my next one bye